I think for me it was probably that being independent was such an important thing. I was gonna say the same thing. I felt like she really instilled in us to be self-sufficient, to not depend on anybody, and to just make our own way in the world, to be independent. Yeah, it was the big message was that you don't need someone to dream big, then go get those dreams, take care of yourself, do what you want. Yeah. You don't need to worry about it. Anyone's out there for you, you're, you're out there for you. I agree. I want my babies to inherit a world where love is more the idea that is kind of in the air every day as opposed to worry and fear and hate and <laughs> these type of things or problems. I feel like sometimes we're so in a problem-based way of thinking all the time, which problem are we going to solve next instead of thinking in a grateful way, I have this and I have that and we should all be giving love and we should all be treating each other a certain way and and um, being conscious of each other. Um, that's 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 how I want them to live and that's how I, how, the world I would want them to live in. That's exactly what I think. Someone said to me when we first started working together on our foundation stuff that Jennifer has enough love in her to feel, fill the whole world. And I, A, I love that, but B, I thought to myself, that's all of us, that's everybody, you yeah. know? You have yeah. enough love in you to make that your world and make that the basis of what we do and how we go forward. Since we've been working on Global Mom, I got to talk to some of the young girls, some of the teen advisors for Girl Up and stuff, and they all already know that. Yeah. And I kind of love, and they all want that too. They want a world where they don't have to do the work that they do, you know, to try to make the world a better place. We'll have already sort of yeah. rolled along Instilled in that path that. already. Sleep when the baby sleeps. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. It's real simple advice. We don't, I don't like ever giving advice to people on anything. I just feel like you live by example and you just try to do the best that you can. Every child is different, I feel like. And you just, you know, you, nobody knows your child like you know your child. And you just have to be there for them in every moment, in every way that you can. That's it. Actually, you know, there's no perfect way to, to be a mom. You just have to love your child unconditionally, which is a truly natural thing that happens, and then do the best you can. Mm -hmm. The best thing someone said to me was, you're doing okay. Like, you have to keep that in mind. You're doing okay. It yeah. may get overwhelming sometimes or feel very... Daunting. Daunting. But you're in your heart, you know you're wanting to do the right thing and the good thing and the best thing all the time. So yeah. as long as that's the case, you're doing okay. Right. It's just about you have to be present and you have to love them. It's really true, yeah. but that's all you need. Yeah.